I am just about to do the mouse mix by mice and uh, I thought I would video it so that people can get an idea of what I feed them and this is the first time I made up this mix because usually they're on just on plain wag mouse munch but I got um, fed up of feeding him that because it, I don't think it's very good I'm out of breath, I've just been running upstairs so um, this is what I'm going to put in it this is what my recipe is in we've got um, plain rice cereal with hardly any sugar we've got corn pasta and rice and millet pasta we've got wag um, bunny brunch as a base and we've got a uh, puppy complete mix which is just dog kibble and oats and pearl barley and this is what I'm going to put it in because I finally got hold of one <laughs> okay so I got this mix from the mice are nice forums and I'm gonna give it a go um, the only thing I didn't get is the pedigree small bite kibble I got the puppy kibble instead so let's get going for each thing it says a certain number of scoops I'm going to use this as the scoop because it's a scoop that comes with the box and I'll just do one lot of the mix and show you that and then I'll just keep repeating that until the box is full first I'm going to start with the WAG Bunny Brunch it just looks like that it looks very similar to um, hamster food and that will be the base for the mix sorry for the uh, stops and starts in this video but I don't have a tripod so <laughs> that's five scoops of the WAG Bunny Brunch to start with as a bit of a base and now I've added two scoops of the uh, Asda Hero Puppy Complete which just looks like that, I don't know if you can see it but I've added that to the mix I've now added one scoop of plain porridge oats I've now added one scoop of pearl barley and one scoop of corn pasta and four scoops of low sugar cereal and the finished product looks like that and then I'm just going to carry on until the tub is full and that's how you make mouse food I forgot to add that because I am changing them from the WAG hamster gerbil mouse munch I add a few scoops of that into the new mix so that their tummies don't get too upset and they get used to changing over before I remove that completely now I've mixed everything together and filled my tub it just looks like that and then I have a lot of materials left over from making it, ingredients, materials, whatever so this should last me a long time and it only cost me about £7 maybe, £10 to buy all of this and it's probably going to last me a fair few months Thank you for watching.